Tracy and Hepburn, Brando, Groucho, and James Dean are among the stars who found themselves in the range of Phil Stern's camera. Now Stern has gathered his best in a book that gives us a one-of-a-kind view of life in Hollywood. 73-year-old photographer Phil Stern has spent half a century shooting stars for magazines. Now he's picked out some of his favorites. The one they would most recognize would probably be the Jimmy Dean one here. Uh, this has appeared in posters, magazine covers, book covers, uh, advertising, brochures, uh, you name it. And it's my favorite from the point of view that it's made a rich man out of me. If Phil is rich, it's because he captured moments like this one of James Dean in 1955, or this young Marlon Brando during happier days in 1954, or how about Sophia Loren and John Wayne? It took Phil four years to dig through thousands of photos to get just the right ones for his book, Phil Stern's Hollywood. He even found some he almost threw away, like the slightly out-of-focus shot of John Kennedy and Frank Sinatra. I found a number of photographs that I had marked kill. And then looking at them a second time, after many years, I discovered that those kill pictures, which were either out of focus or had some sort of erratic composition, were now in vogue. And thank God I didn't throw them away. Phil Stern's Hollywood is on sale in bookstores now.